today I'm in beautiful Dalesford and if you remember back to my Aussie travel tips video nearby here is where my friend Rachel grew up and this was her top tip for me to visit. Now I've never been to Dalesford so instead of researching a bunch of things to do I went straight for local advice. Rachel gave me a heap of suggestions so here are the top five things to do when you're in Dalesford. Now Rachel also told me to look out for these mineral springs. They're scattered all around Dalesford. Now the water comes from Locarno Spring, which is a natural spring where rainwater is percolated through underground rock. Now it comes to the surface through a bush reserve in Hepburn Springs, which is six kilometers north of Dalesford. Now Rachel didn't rate these too well. She said the water was quite sulfuric, but her tip for me was to try and find the least bad tasting water. So I I'm at Central Springs now and I'm going to give this one a go. Here's a cup I prepared earlier. Let's give it a pump. All right, bottoms up. It's quite nice. I'm not a fan of mineral water, um, but it's quite bubbly, tastes really fresh. Um, a little bit bitey, but yeah, this one's not too bad. Cheers. So the second thing to do in Dalesford is go visit wineries. Now you might be asking, why am I standing in front of this sign that says wineries? Well, Rachel suggested a winery for me to go to. I drove all the way there and it was closed. I was gonna select another one. And then when I really thought about it, I don't drink that much anymore. I'm a complete lightweight and wine tasting would be a big mistake considering I'm the only one driving this thing. So if you're ever visiting Dalesford, I'm gonna put a bunch of wineries down here below for you to visit. But for me, I think I'm gonna spend the afternoon searching for more of those natural springs. and I'm spending it at Dalesford Spa Country Railway and at Dalesford Sunday Markets. So the markets are on every Sunday and it's pretty huge. Uh, the car parks are pretty packed, uh, but there's a wide range of things to offer. Our stalls and food, there's music, and it's right by the railway. And you can actually book a ticket to ride the train all the way down to Bellardo. Now, you might remember that Rachel told me she grew up in Bellardo and I spoke to her yesterday and she said, if you had the time, take a trip to Bellardo. Well, the train's gonna take me there. So I booked a spot. Um, here's my ticket, I'm ready to go. I actually think my train is about to leave. So let's head off.
things on and back here we're off the train stretching our legs in Bellardo. I'm here at the convent. It's just behind me up those stairs and this place is incredible. Originally, it was actually a convent in the 1860s. Then it was a boarding house and most recently it was a community center. But now it's open to the public and it is incredible inside. There are multiple galleries utilizing all levels of the convent. There's a cafe, a bar, a wedding function center and a beautiful beautiful altar. Now there's an admission to get in but once you get in you get a brief history of the convent and then you do your own self-guiding tour. Let me show you around. I'm at my fifth and final destination here and I think I've saved the best till last. I'm at a mineral spa. Now, I'm not one to book into spa treatments, but it was on Rachel's list, so I thought I'd give it a go. So I'm at the mineral spa. It's in Hepburn Springs and I've booked the retreat. So the retreat is a mineral springs therapy zone where you have mineral springs, a cool plunge pool, a sauna, a detox box and a steam room. So you can work your way around those. I've got an hour in here. I'm not really sure what to expect, but I'm sure it's going to be incredible. All right, my appointment is just about to start, so I'm gonna go inside.
you know what? I think I'm the only one in Dalesford who actually enjoys these mineral springs. It's probably because I don't like normal mineral water or sparkling water or tonic water. That gives me an idea. I might just mix this with a little bit of gin tonight. Might start a new craze in Dalesford. <laughs> I'll see you next time.